and welcome to our guide to a record label. Today we will be talking about what a record label is and explaining the function of one. A record label is a company in which you sign a contract in order for the company to pay for the same recording and the costs to advertise and promote your music. When a record label signs an artist, this means they have an exclusive contract with the company. record label is one of the key businesses in the recording industry and some examples of record labels are Warner, Sony and Universal. A record label is made up of different departments that all have an executive vice president. These departments all have different jobs. The main departments in a record label are the A&R, promotion, artist development, marketing, publicity department, new media, sales, art department, business affairs and legal department. There are many more sub-departments that are within the main departments. A&R or artists and repertoire is considered to be the most glamorous department because it is in charge of finding new talent. The A&R have a whole look at the artist's work. For example, if the artist wants the art changing, he will let the A&R know and they will talk to the art department. The art department is in charge of all the artwork that goes into advertising and CD covers. Artist development is responsible for planning the career of the artist and looks at their future. It promotes the artist over their career. The record companies do not have an artist development anymore because the record company sees the artist as a product. They do this because they want to make money instead of looking after them and seeing them as important people. The business affairs are in charge of the finances and payroll which is paying people off and so on. Label liaison usually has one person or a small group of people and they take care of all the discussions with the record label's distribution company. The legal department is in charge of sorting out all of the contracts between the artist and the record label. They also take care of the contracts between other companies and any issues that arise such as lawsuits between the artist and the company. Lawsuit meaning that they are suing the company, for example, not paying the artist. The marketing department is in charge of dealing with the overall marketing plan for every album the record label releases. This department links with promotion, sales and publicity departments as it helps coordinate the plans for these departments. The new media department is a more modern department. It looks at promoting the artists over the internet. They do this by producing music videos and music to stream for the artist on the internet. The promotion department makes sure that the artist gets on the radio. In order for their future success with the record label, they will need to get on the radio. This department makes sure that the other departments are communicating about the best way to sell the artist to the public. They will also try to get music played on MTV or other music channels. The publicity department is responsible for getting the word out for new artists. It arranges newspaper and magazine articles to be written and takes care of radio and TV coverage of, the, of an artist. The sales department has an overview on the retail part of the music. They make sure that the artist's music goes onto the shelves. Sales will link with the promotion department and the publicity department which also spread the word about the artists on the TV and the radio. Thank you for listening to our podcast and I hope you enjoyed it. Goodbye. Bye.